Welcome back. Today is day four of One Step Equations. And today we're going to kind of just look at everything again. It's going to be a review of everything. So we are remembering that in an equation we are trying to get x by itself. And we get x by itself by doing the inverse operation to both sides, which keeps our equation balanced. Our inverse operations are plus and minus. They work together, they're the inverse of each other. And then we have multiplying and dividing. Those are also inverse operations that we're going to be using. So let's just do a few review problems here. We have different variables today. So we have a minus one equals five. So here's our operation right here, that minus one. So we're going to plus one which will make that zero, so all we're left with is a. We plus one over here, and we ha are left with six on this side. So a equals six. Okay, let's look at another one. k times six equals 18. So what was the inverse operation of multiplying? That's right, dividing. So we're gonna use our fraction bar for dividing. We'll divide by six. The six divided by six equals one, so we're left with k, and then we'll divide this side by six to keep it balanced, and we get k is equal to three. And you can check that, go back here, three times six equals 18, so we know that we're on the right track there. Okay, let's look at another one. When it looks like a fraction like this, it says x divided by three, so we are going to multiply. So when we do that, this is a three divided by three, even though we're multiplying, we've got a fraction of one. So we're left with X on this side and we multiply by three on this side, three times three is nine, X equals nine. Um, sometimes the variable can be on the other side, not a problem, we still do the same things. So the number next to the variable is six, that's the one we're trying to move. This is six times t, so we're going to divide both sides by six. 24 divided by six is four. Six divided by six is one. So we get four is equal to t, or t equals four. So yeah, that's just some practice problems for today. Good luck on your lesson and your practice, and we'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye-bye.